Welcome back everybody, it's time to lock down some MTGO, we're playing some mill today. And uh, looks like, yeah I'll keep this hand, I'll keep this hand, I like it, I like it, I gotta get focused here. I like just ran up here to record for the day, I didn't get to uh, pre-record all my videos like I usually do on Sunday, so uh, I'm doing it <laughs> on the daily here. Um, I think we'll just go venture deeper, take a peek into what we're dealing with, I always like doing that. Uh, so we're playing up against some blue, which uh, means Drowner Initiate will be pretty good. Uh, blue whites. Oh, I gain one life. Oh, it's a life gain deck. Okay. Fair enough, fair enough. Pop this out so you guys can see a little bit too. Uh, so yeah, so I'm... Uh, <laughs> I gotta get into the swing uh, of what we're we're all about here. So uh, let's... Uh, let's see. How do we want to set this up here? Might be good to get the flyer down right away. Um, well, maybe not right away. We'll definitely thought scour while we can. Don't know if they're going to be playing with any counter spells, but they are doing blue. Uh, we got another one of these. We got six cards in. All right, we'll we'll wait a turn. We'll just do another venture deeper here for now. That seems reasonable. Yeah. So this is a blue white life gain deck. We'll crack their evolving. We'll hit a Mull Drifter. Very cool. And a Ghostly Flicker. Oh, they're playing black too. Alright. I don't know what they're on about, but we'll see how we can do here. Oh yeah, I'm not focused at all right now. Defender. Alright, well, our uh, Jace's Phantasm will be pretty useful for that. Uh, it's a late Mystic Sanctuary. Uh, pretty unfortunate. I think I'll hold on to that for now. Uh, maybe... We can get back our Thought Scour or something like that if we draw another island in a few turns. Uh, we only really need two mana to play this out anyways. I think I'm going to Brainstorm first. And let's see. We'll just go ahead and put these two back. Yeah, we'll put these two back. We'll go Jace's Phantasm. And then we'll pass. And we could set for some big mill in next turn. I want to get the pressure out while uh, while we can. Since they do have the Mystic Saint. Um, well, we haven't seen any counter spells yet, so I apologize if I'm a little bit off right now. But we're going to do what we need to do with the mill. Slide this over and up. There we go. Snap. Snap back to the reality. Alright. Jason Phantasm back in our hand. Not a big deal. And there we go. So are they playing red too? We haven't seen any red. I think they're just doing the blue-black thing here. There's our Mind Sculpt. Oh, do we just want a Mind Sculpt? They're holding up an island, so are they playing with what I think they're playing with? Let's go Tome Scour first. Just try to keep the mill going. Does happen. No counter spells yet. I don't want to really get hit by a counter spell. Mm. Yeah, we'll try it. Alright, it comes back out. That's fine. Maybe there's a reason to play this Mystic Sanctuary, but I really want to get some value out of it. I think we're we're in fine shape right now. There's not a lot of pressure going on, and we don't uh, care about their life gain. So, this is fine. They just drew two cards. They're at 30 cards. 31 cards. Fine by me. So, let's see here. They cost one less. They can regenerate this guy. All right, let's see what's happening here. Just gonna pass, sure, sure, sure. Um, I just want a mind sculptor. To, I think I'll ponder. Yeah, let's ponder. All right, so Curse of the Bloody Tomb actually would be pretty nice, but I think that'll be last on our list here. Uh, memory sleuth. Yeah, we could start doing memory sleuth. So I think I'll do that, and I'll do this on top. Say no. And we will start getting these memory sleuths down. Uh, so I think I'll play out just a... Yeah, we'll, we'll venture deeper again. Sure. 
And that'll start just dropping our creatures, and we can start memory sleuthing a ton. Which will be pretty nice. Conspire on those bad, bad boys. Uh, I should have attacked in. I didn't attack in. My bad, guys. See, I told you I'm a little bit off. <laughs> like I said, I uh, just ran up here. I'm trying to get this going. Alright. They brought that back. That's fine. I, I'm, I might just play this Mystic Sanctuary now. I keep doing this deep analysis, which is helping us a little bit. Draw the cards. Sure. Yeah, we could have been swinging in for five. Totally missed it. Totally just skipped through. So they do have prohibit. So they do got some counter spells. Yeah, they're just gonna pass. All right. So yeah, let's just go with the game plan here. Cast one of these bad boys. And they're just defending, so I'd rather just go with the mill right now. So we'll conspire. And just get them. Get them for a lot. Get them for eight. Oh, are they going to counter? Oh, Ash Baron's okay. That's fine. Uh, same targets as we do. Get them to 16 cards. We should be able to finish them off in the next couple turns here. Game plan is not their life total, and I think they would be able to bounce back pretty fast anyways, so. Go ahead, swing for one. There you go. <laughs> Got me on a 20 turn clock. Look at you. It'll be interesting to see what they sideboard, that's for sure. All right, I'm just going to play this. I mean, we basically got the win in hand anyways coming up, um, so it's not a huge deal. Uh, 15 cards. Yeah, we'll just... Uh, oh, they're holding up all their mana right now? Mmm. Don't really like that. Don't really like that. Um, you know what? We're just going to do a Drowner Initiate. We're going to get him out. I'd rather tap him anyways. And, yeah, I want for them to tap out. I feel like they're holding up counter spells because they know they're close to, to dying here. Uh, we'll choose you, but we got to say no. Let's see. Ah, yeah, save targets. Say no. Say okay. Yeah, we'll just do it like this. And we'll swing in for the heck of it. Why not? Let's not miss our attack step anymore, shall we? They could have been at 9 life right now. <laughs> they haven't really gained a whole lot. So maybe they're on a, a different game plan here than what I'm thinking. Doing a whole lot of nothing. There's a ghostly flicker. Alright. Popping these. Say no. Say okay. So, what are you getting back with Mystic? So they can just keep getting stuff back from their graveyard, which is pretty cool. So we're gonna grab Muldrifter. Sure, draw your cards, man. And Ghostly Flicker again. Okay. They're only helping us here. So, I think next turn we'll try to Mind Sculpt. And if they counter the Mind Sculpt, we'll Memory Sleuth. Can't pay for it right now. They're just helping our mill with this mole drifter. They want to flicker him a bunch? Sure. <laughs> oh, is this loud? Oh, this feels loud. Sorry, guys, if that music was blaring. Oh, boy. Hopefully it wasn't too loud the whole time for you. So, nope, they're not going to hit the mole drifter. Is there like an infinite loop thing they can do here or something? So they can get Ghostly Flicker back. Alright. 
So denizen is what they got back. I'm just gonna yield through this turn. Uh, there's really nothing I can do right now, so. They're just helping us. Yep, yep. Okay. Say no. Go see Flicker. Say no. This is the annoying part about Drowner Initiate. <laughs> it's all these triggers. Yep. So they're targeting me with Sage. So they are, are they on like a, a mill thing too here? Maybe they are. It's like Ghostly Flicker. Say no. Everything costs, does everything cost one less right now? No, I don't think so. Oh yeah, they do. Yep, from the Sunscape. So they can do the Ghostly Flicker a ton of times. Yeah, so I think they go infinite here, right? Uh, I haven't seen this before, so I'm sorry if I'm like hanging around too long. If they have the infinite combo, I apologize. I'm just trying to get information about the deck because I haven't really played this one. Uh, but it seems like they're on the mill plan, and if they can go infinite, then that's pretty crazy. I'm just going to start saying... This is what I need to do here. Can I always say no for him? Guess not. So now they're milling me out. Are we just getting we're just getting out milled? Ah, it's terrible. So maybe it was uh, the, a mistake to not play the Mystic Sanctuary sooner. Maybe we could have gotten one more spell off. Don't know if we would have made it, though. We might have had him at, like, eight cards if we had the Mystic Sanctuary up for a turn. Maybe had him at eight cards in library. Uh, I don't think it would have helped. But we're definitely going to bring in some relics against this deck. Yeah, I think we're just on a loop here, so... Because they just keep flicking... These, look at top two cards. That comes back. All right, we'll concede. They they got us. They got us. It's it's an infinite loop. I'm sorry, guys. That's fine, though. That's fine. Now we know. All right, so Relic coming in. What else would we want from this? Echoing Truth might not be too bad as well, uh, but actually I think the counter spells are just going to be a little bit more handy. We'll take out the Curses. Take out a ponder. Where are we at? 62. We gotta cut two more. Jace's Phantasm isn't super relevant in this. Maybe we can cut one Secret Keeper. Mm, I'd rather just cut. I'd rather just cut a couple Jaces. Um, seems more reasonable. I want to keep in all our all our mill stuff still. Uh, yeah, let's run it like this. We will play first. This is a reasonable hand. Don't want to throw it back. Um, let's see. Let's just do a thought scour here, get an extra card going, get some advantage. Pass to them. All right, so we got two Tome Scours. Let's just Tome Scour it. I don't want to go too deep into their graveyard if we don't have to. 
uh, before we get like you know a relic on board or something like that. Um, <laughs> seven cards in, huh? Let's uh, let's put out a Jace. We'll get right to swing in with him next turn. All right. Maybe we'll just go on the beatdown plan. Definitely do one of these just so we can start swinging in. I think we'll brainstorm even. Yeah, pass. We'll brainstorm. Seagate setting up their stuff. Uh, we'll wait till they pass to the end of turn here. Oh boy, okay. We'll drop another Dispel and uh, a Memory Sleuth. We don't need them quite yet. Since we don't have two creatures out. Uh, let's just go ahead and... Go ahead and mind sculpt, I guess. Mystical dispute, probably. Negate. Okay, that's fine. We're still swinging in for five a turn. We're just gonna race. They still took quite a few turns to set up their combo, so maybe Jace is better in this deck. Actually, <laughs> who knows? Like maybe he is just gonna win us this game right now. But yeah, maybe there's. Uh, a better reason to take out just the Drowner Initiates and um, keep it in the Jaces. Mull Drifter. All right. Oh, uh, we can drop Jace again. And do we want to just hold up, like, a Dispel, just in case I try to go off next turn? I think I kind of want to do that. They're getting kind of close, I feel like, where maybe they can do something. If they, like, try to Ghostly Flicker a Mole Drifter or something like that. Uh, they're going to pay the three life for that? Ooh. That's two cards, sure. All right. Seagate, they can have that. They're just trying to dig to their combo, it seems like. Definitely dispel that. Keep our guy around. Yeah, we might just want to protect the Jace now, honestly. Island. Well, we'll swing. Block with Mole Drifter, probably. No, no blocks. Okay, they go to two. We're gonna Tome Scour. They got Deep Analysis in there. We'll go, uh, we'll do a Memory Sleuth, sure. We don't always have to do it for Conspire. Pass the turn with the spell up. There's the Mystic Sanctuary. This is where uh, we need to be cautious. So they're grabbing Prohibits. Okay. ghostly flicker this i mean i don't want them to ghostly flicker right now maybe they got something else they can do but they just got another one okay sure <laughs> all right so they'll draw two more cards uh do they go infinite here maybe we should have waited got him close jace uh, almost killed him so there's a ghostly flicker again we're just gonna 
yield through this turn. Let them do what they need to do. Um, they'll draw a bunch of cards until they get their denizen, I suppose. I think that's all they need is just their denizen. And then they can go infinite, so... He's like all the way at the bottom, <laughs> I guess. Holy crap. They be digging hard. Man, their Denison was far down in their deck. We had so much time, too. I don't know what was the best thing to counter there. I think we just had to go for countering the Ghostly Flicker, and if they had more than one, then they just had it, right? Um, maybe there was something better I could have countered, but I think we had to just go for countering the Ghostly. That is their game plan. Pretty cool. I like it. Oh man, they're digging deep. They're at nine cards. About to go to seven. Or eight. Oh yeah, because this one's like putting one on top. Yep, that's funny. So only going down one card at a time. It's interesting. <laughs> Where is this guy hiding? Like, really? So funny. Like, they just need Denizen. Or is there another win con? Is there another win con? There's the denizen. Oh my gosh, it's about time. All right, well, we'll give them the we'll give them the GG. Oops, why is that popping up still? There we go. GG. Now they start milling us. Good game. I like it. All right. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed too. Leave a like on the video if you did. Make sure to subscribe if you're enjoying the mill. Sorry for the late upload today. Again, I, I have to start catching up on my days here and pre-recording a little bit more. So a little bit later of an upload, but hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and we will see you guys in the next video.